Good morning and welcome to another work week in the life of a student pharmacist vloggy vlog. Um, it is currently, let's see, I'm putting on my real glasses. It's currently 8.31. I just parked at our like corporate office um, because this week we have this really big presentation that we're putting on um, for another clinic that's like visiting um, and I've been very very involved with that so this is gonna be like me um, basically showing off my baby so I just parked um, that's why it's kind of dark because I'm at the I'm like in the parking garage but um, yeah I um, stopped and got starbs on the way in I got the venti caramel salted caramel cold brew with almond milk um but yeah i'm gonna head in and today's gonna be like an eight to six day maybe but we shall see but yeah got to we all oh, forgot to say i went to the gym this morning at 5 30 so we're already starting the week off on a great foot um so let's get it Many, many hours later, I'm currently at a light, headed home. Um, today went very well. Um, I'm exhausted though, honestly. You know, like, cause like, I was on, we were on like, not high alert, but you know, you're just like on 10 until the people get there. Um, you know, just getting last minute stuff. So I was like making sure the agendas were printed, making sure like all of the like marketing materials and we're in there, you know, um, finding pens. Cause like, that was like the one thing we forgot was just like um, our pens. So I had to go find the like um, clinics imprinted pens, um, highlighters, um, trying to like <laughs> scale things so that, you know, the color printer prints, you know, this chart good. It's just, you know, just the random stuff. Um, so, I feel like I was just like on 10 until everything started. And then once I started and I was like manning, um, like I was basically the tech girl during the presentation, just like pulling up the different files, um, running the reports real time. And also just like, um, flipping the slides. Like once all that stuff started and you're just like stagnant, you get kind of tired. Um, so I'm pretty exhausted now. I really just want to take off these real pants and put on sweatpants very excited to do that but um we have leftover dinner from yesterday we went to see uh, my family and i and adam we went to see um what's it called fast nine and um afterwards we got dinner at taco mac um, and watched the hawks game so that was fun so i have leftover dinner from that and i'm just gonna basically pop that stuff in my air fryer and do that and Unfortunately, or I guess fortunately, I'm happy to have a job that I'm so invested in, but I have some work that I need to do tonight, which might take up about two hours of my time. Um, but I knew this was coming because of this presentation and stuff. So I do have some work tonight for tomorrow's presentation. Um, luckily, the morning time is going to be mainly like a catch up of whatever questions they had from today. They're going to be touring our... Duluth location because we just expanded it into like dental services and like food services so they're touring they're going to be touring those two expansions tomorrow morning so that gives like me time to go to our presentation center and just kind of like set stuff up and restart for the day um so I'm really excited about that that I don't have to be on you know I don't have to be on extrovert <laughs> time so early um stuff like this really reminds me how big of a introvert i really am i feel like no one will ever believe me but i really am I, <laughs> it's funny um but yeah I mean, overall it was a good day i'm didn't get to have lunch because we were just like running you know it, was, it really it's like three of us manning this entire presentation this entire like three day <laughs> training so like it's kind of hard to be like yeah let me go step away for 45 minutes and eat like i don't think any of us ate like i had like we i think each of us had like snacks um but like we had um snacks in the presentation room so i just kind of like stow some like m ms and like of course i have my water bottle with me but yeah so tomorrow's probably gonna 
be a little bit better because I'm at least in the morning I get to have some downtime by myself. I did have some downtime today, which was in that um, time lapse you guys saw. That was basically me making sure like literally everything looked perfect. And um, that was me like finishing up the PowerPoints, adding stuff. Um, like I created this like insignia to put on the PowerPoint that says like see workbook or like um, we will run this thing with you. I created that to put on the PowerPoints um, so that, you know, we can do it in real time and they get to you know, take notes on their actual workbook that I created for them. But the thing is you have to make sure that you actually like print out the right stuff or put it on the right slide. So I just like literally was like combing through that because it's not just pharmacy, it's also the finance team. So I needed to make sure that like everyone did the right parts and sent everything to me so that I could do everything right. So that's what you guys saw earlier. Um, but yeah, overall it's good. Um, I like this step. I'm starting really, really kind of like the admin and operations side, but I don't see myself ever wanting to be like a director of pharmacy or like a manager. I not, I don't, I don't think I could do this every day, all day, honestly, but overall it's good. I'm pulling up at home now, so I'm going to eat some grub and work for the rest of the night a little bit, but I have been up since 5 30 though because i went to the gym this morning so that could be also why i'm pretty tired but overall pretty good pretty good hello it's 10 30 and i am now i finished like some work and stuff I had to go relax some videos. Um, finish Photoshop and about to get in bed. I'm pretty tired, honestly. I got when I got home, I like kind of was like super hangry, so I ate some leftovers that I had from yesterday. And then we needed more cat food, so we ran to Kroger to get cat food. And then we were fixing our shower, so we ran to Lowe's to fix that. And yeah, came back, and then I just sat down on my computer finished editing a video that's going up right now um it was a words in my work bag um because i got a lot of questions about my dagny and dover bag and so i figured i'd do a quick little sit down video so that just went up so be sure to watch that i'll put it in the cards um but yeah other than that i'm about to go to bed um kind of have a headache honestly um so yeah early morning again so Yay! Good morning! Happy Tuesday. Um, it is currently 8.41. I just got in my car. It is drizzling a little bit and my like car is like foggy so I'm just like cleaning off my windshields and stuff like that right now. But um, yeah, today on the agenda is um, I'm starting the day in Shambly. Actually, I'm going to be in Shambly all day, yeah. Um, the group that we're hosting, they're starting the day in our Duluth location. They're doing a tour and all that stuff. So they're starting the morning there. They're not going to be here until I think like 11. So we've got a good like barrier time to get things printed I have to run by Sam's Club to get creamer for the office um, and that's really it yeah just printing running by Sam's Club and fixing a few things and then they will be here and then we will start the second day of stuff so just like answering questions from the day before and then starting to talk about our 340b program um, financial reporting and all that good stuff and then um, after that is lunch, we're going to Dixie Q Barbecue. Um, I'm not really a barbecue person, but I'm pretty sure on there I saw like some seafood, so I don't mind like that stuff. And then we're gonna be coming back for the second half of the day. And then at 6.30, well, we, we all get off at five. So we're stopping at five, and then we're letting them go to their hotel and stuff and change, and then we're all meeting at um, Belenza's, which is this like fancy, I think Italian? It's either Italian or like Moroccan um, restaurant in Buckhead. So I'm going to my pharmacist's house actually to change and then we're gonna like take her golf cart there. But yeah, so I'm headed out now. Um, probably gonna make coffee at the office after I get the um, creamer. So that's what's on the agenda right now. You guys have a good day.
good morning happy wednesday today is day three of our hosting gig um and so today is only like nine to one so i'm very excited about that i'll probably be here only like half the day i'm hoping um last night was so much fun but i did not get home until about 10, i'm gonna say 9 50 um, which actually was not that bad um Basically, we went to dinner at Valenza, which was this beautiful Italian restaurant. I actually rode with my um, pharmacist. So we met at her house, like two of us met at her house, and we had like a glass of wine and stuff. And then we rode over on her golf course, which was like really, really fun and funny. And then, you know, we had dinner. Um, I had this really good cocktail at dinner called the um, Paper Plane. I'll have to put the recipe in shot in here, but it was so good. But my tummy is so upset right now because like I had so many things I don't typically eat last night. So like she's not the happiest right now. Um, like I don't really do dairy like that. Um, I like try to minimize as much dairy as possible. And I had um, baked macaroni and cheese at the barbecue place because that's like a common thing but i had collard greens with it which was pretty good but um they didn't have any more salmon for for like what i the dish i wanted i had to have pulled pork which i don't typically eat pork like that like maybe like once a year or something but um so that was very interesting um but yeah so and then for dinner i had spaghettini stomach my stomach's just not really happy today which is understandable i like i don't eat like that normally um but none of the other options were like what i wanted and also i didn't pay for dinner or lunch or anything like yesterday so like i just wanted to be as respectful as possible i had to head up because i think this session starts at nine and there's nothing we need to prepare for so then in mind that i'm kind of late but it's good we're gonna have a good day um other than that, tomorrow's Adam's birthday, so I think I'm gonna try to stop by Container Store to pick up his birthday present. Um, he has these drop front shoe boxes because he loves showcasing his shoes, which he deserves to. He has like some dope and expensive shoes, but they now have extra large boxes. So I want to get those for him because they just released them. And I'm like in the sneaker community, everyone has these boxes, but they have been pushing for them to like make extra large boxes because people who have large shoes, like Adam wears a 12 and a 13, 12, 12 and a half to like 13 one of those and um sometimes if you like his high top shoes they don't fit standing up in the box he has to like lay them sideways so we really want I, he really really wants those he showed me them over the weekend he was like oh my god we gotta go get these and i was like yeah yeah but really i took note and i'm probably gonna pick them up today so i'm excited ah! hello huh. our three-day training is officially over oh my gosh i am so emotionally drained like honestly i think we all are like super emotionally drained right now because like it's been three days of us on like extrovert level 10 you know and then just like being up early to get everything done every morning cleaning up all that good stuff so today is officially oh, officially over now they left about one um i did some cleaning up you know powering down everything in the convention room or the presentation room um and i was like i'm gonna go take a nice long lunch and they're like you deserve it plus they were like interviewing someone anyway at three so i was like i'm gonna time this perfectly so now i have um i share an office it's it's pretty big like it doesn't bother me at all and plus i love who i share it with um but since she's in that interview at three i basically have some alone time from like two to four so i went and got some lunch um sent the one last email and stuff and yeah so now I'm headed back. I picked up Chipotle because I was like, I didn't want Panera. I didn't want the other stuff around. So I was like, I'll just drive a few blocks over and get Chipotle. Plus I had some rewards. So yeah, now I'm headed back. And the rest of the day is just probably going to be like catch up work. Um, like catch up from stuff that I've been away from for the last three days. Um, probably just like do some other stuff like i have some school related stuff but not really school related stuff i'm helping with so probably going to work on that stuff too and then of course um 
I'm putting together like a follow-up email to send to the people that we trained or the people that we hosted because they wanted some documents that I created um, some like of our like SOPs that I've turned from like just straight paragraphs to like nice infographics they want some of those um, so stuff like that so and then they want some contact information to like certain reps we have um, that have helped us along the way because like through the 340b space is really difficult to navigate and so this is like the they want to know they want to work with reps who work with us who understand what the heck is going on in 340b and understand it so um that is what i'm going to send them um and then honestly after today that's really it that i have to do for them we are all connected on linkedin and stuff um they want to fly us out to indiana sometime this year so that's gonna be really fun i really hope i get to go um other than that that's it i'm once I finish work today, I'm going to stop by the container store to get Adam's birthday present. I'm so excited. I already checked to see they're in stock. Um, and they are. And I did. I was going to do curbside pickup. But I kind of want to see. Like, they typically have, like, one out that you can, like, legit see. And I also haven't chosen a color yet. So, I don't know. So, that's also why I didn't order pickup. Because I want to, like, go in and look. Um, and also look at some other stuff for our closet. So, just kill your one stone. And then that is it um for today and tomorrow i'm off so i'm so excited but hotel So it is about three o'clock. I'm home. I had some lunch. Um, I picked us up some Panera on the way home from like doing all that stuff at school. I did my meeting there and I finished up those videos there. Um, so I'm taking kind of a brain break before I hop back on the computer and do some like computer stuff I need to do for honestly a, a good bit today to be honest because I haven't got anything done. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna hop on probably about I think I'm gonna do five. I think I'm gonna do five is when I'm gonna hop back on. But I'm gonna finish up some laundry real quick and then we're gonna go for a walk. And then we're gonna do a cool down at our pool because we never actually get to go to our pool. Um, on the weekends, we're just like not really interested. And if we do get interested, then like people people are already having like a party or people are already there and I just don't want to deal with that. I kind of just like sit at our pool. So we're probably gonna do that. And I'm very excited because we haven't gotten to go to the pool here yet. So gonna do these housewife duties right quick. Alright, so this is what I was talking about for Adam's present. I just want to freaking reference how large these extra large boxes are. Say hello to cat. Hi yums. Okay, so these are the normal boxes. These are large. He obviously can't fit small. I can fit small. But these are the large ones. Ew. Please look how large extra large is next to the current largest. <laughs> like literally Yami can fit in there. <laughs> So he's gonna put it next to one of the largest currently. That is freaking huge. Okay, so he mainly got them for like his like high top sneakers. That's what I was telling you guys yesterday when I was picking it up. He has to put them sideways, you know, versus mids and low top stuff can just go like, you know, perfectly fine. So that's why he's got the extra large now. So shout out to the sneaker community for letting him know about these. What do you have to see, Ami? But. <laughs>
morning. Happy Friday. Ugh. I am headed to our main office. It's like 8, oh yeah, it's 8 11. Um, I typically get there at 8 30, but after having that huge three day thing this week, we're kind of just like catching up on stuff. So, like, you get there when you get there because we are all pretty exhausted. Um, but I figured I'd go ahead and, as early as possible because tonight we're going to dinner for Adam's birthday. Um, and my reservation is in Midtown Atlanta. And if any of you know Atlanta, Atlanta is an hour away from Atlanta. And it's already a rainy day, so people are just not gonna be on their best behavior today. I'm sure there's gonna be some traffic and some accidents. So I want to get out by at least, uh, at the latest four. Um, our appointments at, our reservations at 645. So I'm sure we'll be there on time, but it just gives us a grace period for me to like get home, for us to decide on outfits and us to like get out there. Um, especially because we might be having someone to come to our house today to fix the shower. And so we don't really know when they're coming. So, oh, so it's kind of like up in the air. But yeah, headed in. I'm bringing my laptop stand today. This is what I typically have on my personal desk for like my laptop when I'm studying. And I put it next to my desktop so that I basically use two screens. But I'm bringing this today because my desk at the office, it's kind of low and I just feel like I'm hunching like this to type on the work laptop. And then I'm back up to look at my desktop that I have at the office. So I'm bringing this so that I could just like have some good posture because my back is hurting. Um, but yeah, good morning so far. We went to the gym this morning at 5.30. Um, got a good little, I didn't do too much. I did like a 30 minute pool workout. Um, sorry, push workout with Sydney Cummings. Um, I'm liking doing my like YouTube workouts at the gym a lot more because like me and Adam use the same set of weights. So like if I need one, I either, if I know for sure I'm gonna be using weights and I have to wait till he's done, and then I work out in the office. And when I work out, I typically work out either like super early, so I don't want to wake up our downstairs neighbors because I do a lot of hit as well. So I do a lot of jumping, a lot of like stuff like that. So I've been really enjoying going to the gym and using the like um, exercise room because no one's ever in there when we go at 5.30 anyway. I get as many weights as I want. Um, and I can like go ham without like worrying about like waking someone up downstairs because our, our the guy underneath, underneath us is pretty old, so I don't want to <laughs> wake him and annoy him. But yeah, I'm headed over now. Got my lunch. Got my Dagny Dover. If you saw that video, I just posted about my review of this bag. Um, I love it. Um, so I think someone asked me the other day on Instagram about my Yeti. I have the 36 ounce Yeti with the straw lid. I'll link it below as well um the, like when you buy the bottle it comes with the regular lip and the, the regular looks pretty nice it's a um like a magnetic top um magnetic sip top so it was really nice but we went on vacation and i just really really wanted the straw one um and i've been like chugging my water ever since now so i'll link that below too um i guess when we're in the spirit of linking things Here's my lunch box. I like that below because I get a lot of questions on Instagram about that too. So I literally, I literally everything right here are like my top five links that I'm always linking. My laptop stand, my lunch box, um, my Yeti most recently, and then my Dagny Dover. And I'm pretty sure I have a $20. You, I'm pretty sure I have a code, like a, um, I have a link that if you get 20, your first order at Dagny Dover is $20 off. So I'll link that below too. But I talked more about the bag and did a whole review on the bag and the most recent video I um, posted. But let's get going. Um, we... Stop by Starbucks on the way back from the gym. So I, I got a venti because it's gonna last me all day. I need to put some ice in here when I get to the office, but my um I helped film some videos over the weekend for an organization at school and their organization president gave me um a gift card and a nice plant for my house. So um definitely using that up, but let's get going. Happy Friday boobs!
It is 3.13. I just got home a lot earlier than ever um, because around like noon, our CEO came into the office and a lot of people were off today anyway. So like our director of finance is off and all that stuff because payroll's already processed. We got paid today. Uh, uh. Um, but just like a lot of people were out today anyway. So like it, the office was looking kind of bare, which didn't really bother me because I, I was in my office, you know, doing my thing. Um, but he was like, hey, like, don't feel pressure to stay today. Um, a lot of people are gone anyway. You guys can go home um, if you want to finish things up at home. And then I couldn't leave at noon when everyone else was leaving because, like, we still had some things to finish up regarding our training that we hosted up this earlier this week. So I needed to finish up this, like, follow-up email that compiled literally, like, basically during the three-day training, I took notes of things they wanted us to share with them um draft letters that we've had to send to insurance companies from other things that i've created like our sops and stuff um and that's standard operating procedures if you guys are new to this and then um just some other stuff with like some contacts to like our specific representatives because um like as i've mentioned before i work in a 340b clinic which is like a special drug program so not every clinic um function is the same way um like i'm a lot different than a traditional Publix. so um they are also a 340b clinic that we hosted and their representative for like mckesson and like their um pharmacy portal they're used to working with like very large entities not like small independent 340b clinics and they wanted our specific representative because she specifically works with these small clinics and so they wanted to get her information because they want someone that can like you know when something arises she can be like oh so and so's clinic did this and this has been helping them so um that's what i've been working on for like the past <laughs> legit the past two days because that's how long it's been taken to get all this information get these um documents redacted and downloaded and all that stuff but that's done so i didn't leave until like two which is fine i typically leave at five anyway so I still got up early. Um, I stopped by TJ Maxx because I needed to return two shirts that I got Adam the other day, just like workout clothing shirts um, for his birthday that didn't, we didn't like the, he didn't like the fit and that's fine. Um, but while I was there, I went in and got us two new hampers because we have the huge TJ Maxx and like Marshall's hampers, but they have like those like linen um, handles and two people that work out and like go to work and then come home so that's like three outfits a day stuffed into that is horrible and our like where our like washer is and stuff there's not enough room for us to like separate 10 loads of laundry to do each day or to do every weekend so we just wanted to like get a smaller hamper but more sturdier this is like a this is really sturdy this is like a wicker one um got that and then I got my mom this new phone case, this coach phone case. Um, it's upside down. Is it? No, it's not. Um, she was taught, she, she, the mom does not live in the same city as me, but she was telling me how she um, saw these cute coach iPhone cases the other day when she was at hers and she went to look through them, but she didn't get a chance. And then la the next time she went, they were gone or something. But mine here had literally 30 of these. So I went ahead and got one just in case this is the one she wanted. And then I just got some new facial toner and that's it. Um, we've got dinner plans at 6.45. I'm so excited because we love this restaurant. Um, I went with like my neighborhood friends. So like my mom and like our two neighbors. I went with her, them a while ago, like right before I was starting grad school. And then me and Adam also ate at this restaurant for Valentine's Day this year, but it was takeout. Um, it was like their like um, restaurant Valentine's Day special. So we did take out there, but now we actually have a reservation to go sit down there. I'm very excited to celebrate Adam's birthday. So I'm excited about to get in, probably edit some of this vlog now and do a little work that I want to get ahead of. Um, so yeah. Good morning. It is Saturday. Um, it's about 8 a.m. I got up early because I wanted to get some stuff done for the upcoming week done before we head out for Pud Shack for Adam's birthday. Um, dinner was amazing last night. I wish I got pictures of um, a clip, but I got photos of our like first half of our meal. Uh, we basically had to get three quarters meal last night, honestly. We got um, our normal appetizer, which is seafood spring rolls. 
And then the owner of the restaurant, like the actual head chef, was actually in the kitchen last night and he had a special appetizer which was like a calamari steak and it was so good. Um, I got a picture of that, but we were just enjoying our time. We had some good drinks and then we also got dessert. Um, we also had our normal dishes. Um, we actually have leftovers because we were like stuffed. I am, I am now just making some morning coffee, get a girl, and when I sit down at my desk in the um, office and start going over some stuff for the upcoming week, that's the only thing that I hated about this three day training that we hosted was that three days away from your emails and like other stuff is actually a lot and not just like it actually wasn't three days so you actually have been preparing for this for almost three weeks so like i've kind of been neglecting some stuff for like i'd say at most a week now so i just really want to get on top of things before the week starts next week and then i just get handed more stuff because yesterday i got assigned another project and then i'm starting another project that we thought of before this training so like i'm back to like working on multiple projects at the same time which i love it's great but i need to get a hold of my emails and like um just everything that's going on and like i might be going to a convention now and a conference in dc now in october and stuff like that so i just need to like i need to look at stuff and write it down um it's now officially july and i still haven't even changed my wallpaper to july one to july so if you hear something in the background it's a little kitty cat running around he was on crack last night and he's on crack right now too but yes that's it i'm probably gonna end this vlog later on but right now just some coffee and then um i'm i don't probably won't be up until like 11 which is great yeah for right now just gonna be some coffee and some work until i set alarm for like 11 15 and that's when i start getting ready for putt shack because our appointment's at 12 20.